Hello guys, Ferdi here and this time I will show you how to make um, sliding transition Yep, it looks like this Yep, something like that It's quite easy transition that you can do So, let's create new composition uh, Yeah, that, this fine, maybe I'll change the duration to 4 second maybe mm, yep and then import the skin to the timeline and this skin just change the uh, opacity uh, give keyframes like this then create new adjustment layer type motion type so with this effects we will get we will create those sliding diagonally sliding transition <laughs> yeah just uh, then create uh, another keyframes in this style and center press U and we will change this value of dimensional to so this can slide so basically you have to I want to make this one to like this but it's very difficult to make it perfect so simply just make it negative and add this with those value times two yeah and it will automatically adjust like this so you like at the border and it looks so ugly so just enable the mirror edge sorry about that and it will give more beautiful looks in this transition but what is this it's flip of course it flip so you just have to flip it again with horizontal and flip it in the vertical and it will change to normal like this yeah. and the motion it's too flat just so we have to change the speed grab you can um, exper experiment experiment with this kind of uh, property it will very helpful to achieve more smooth transition so yep I guess that's enough and it's it's not quite complete if you don't add uh, motion blue but I, I I don't prefer to use this kind of blur it's too you know look at that I don't like it so I just use this uh, motion blur CC force I will this I will use this um, effects to create uh, blur. Just drag it into the adjustment layer, like here or you, like here. It's fine, uh, and you will get this blur. It's very different, even they are same blur. <laughs> okay like this yeah it's finally complete <laughs> but 
I will add one more effects. It's called uh, lens, CC lens. Just import it, place, put it into the adjustment layer, then change the size into okay it's fine you know the difference so it will look it will give the sliding like in inside the spiral uh <laughs> you know uh, i can't find the word so you can tell it by yourself so yeah it's finished so first you have to change this opacity and then create motion tile and change the value the dimensional value x and y so it will add uh, it will you will get the diagonal slide then add some blur yeah i will i use this cc force motion blur and then for yeah oh yeah what is this uh, I don't care <laughs> uh, yeah and yeah uh, adjust the speed graph so you will get more smooth moving transition and if you want if you want change this direction you just uh, yeah can like adjust by yourself you have you may want to uh, experiment by yourself maybe <laughs> you can just copy it like this and then for if you want change it change this to like here just you can inverse those first uh, way so this will add uh, with this multiply two and this add minus easy <laughs> and adjust this speed graph again What is that noise? Yeah, like that. Yeah, it's quite easy, right? And I will put this project. I will upload it, and you can download it. I will put the links in the description. You can download free, of course. Haha. <laughs> I I really happy to sharing with you guys so i hope you enjoy this tutorial and see you in the in another video <laughs> bye see you next time